Good morning, happy Thursday. So, uh, sleeping schedule last night was horrible. Um, I couldn't stand Marinia crying, so I let her come into my bed again, and so we slept with her. Um, guys, let me know how to get that and not give in. But what I've decided, I'm gonna go ahead and do sleep training slowly but surely. Because if I rely on three days and her crying, mine's, I'm going insane. So I don't think I'll do that. And let me show you. My baby girl has started really early. She's reading. You're a genius, baby girl. Yeah. Yeah. Read those animal books. On the other one is still sleeping. We woke up around um, <clears throat> 7.30 and it's 9, 9.15 right now. We already had breakfast, so right now we're having a little bit of playtime. I was just reading her some books. Hope she goes down today at 10 for her nap. And then I can work out and do all that stuff. But yeah, so sleeps and schedule, fail, fail, fail. You're not supposed to be eating the book. You're supposed to be reading the book, Marinia. All done, baby girl. You look so pretty today. Yeah? You want me to give you a teether? Do you want your keys? Let's say your keys to your new house in your new car. So Marinia just ate apple sauce for lunch and she finished the whole bowl. I gave her three ice cubes and she finished the whole bowl. I'm so proud of her. She woke up today with a determination. I'm having applesauce, mommy. So lazy. I don't know why. I am so lazy to take a shower. I have walked out and I've cleaned the house. Um, yeah, but I'm so lazy to take a shower. Thing is that I know I'm not going anywhere, but I need to take a shower. I really need to. But I'm so lazy. I don't want to leave her. I want her to take a, like, if she takes a nap, maybe that's when I'll take a shower. Same time, I'm lazy. Uh. Her mosquito bites. See, I think it's getting bigger and it's getting more pink. Cause there's that one. Baby girl, let me show them. You don't want me to touch your hair? Okay. Your hair is so pretty. I'm not gonna touch it. I'm not gonna mess it. Okay. So you see that one over? Yeah. Okay, baby girl. So I was changing Marinia and I noticed she has like a reaction on her body. I don't know if you guys can see. Look at how red her skin is. I think this is an allergic reaction. We are pretty lazy today, so we're yeah. just gonna sit here. I've tried to put Marinia down for her yes. second nap, but she didn't want to go down. And mommy hasn't How showered yet, <laughs> so we are just gonna sit here and watch Pretty Little Lives. Because, yes. Tell them what you were telling me, baby girl. Go. Yes, go ahead. Go ahead. I didn't think that she should be home alone, so I invited her to stay. I don't feel like taking her to the bed. She's here? Just let her no, no. Sleep over she didn't see that as a very day. tempting offer based on what happened I'm earlier lazy. tonight. And I don't want to move her because I think she'll wait for me. She looks so peaceful and pretty. Give Marinia a little bit of Greek yogurt. This is her first taste test. I did put a little bit in her mouth and she'd. Let's see. Look at her face. <laughs> you don't like it, baby girl? No? Oh, she's pushing my hand. I got this gizzards. It's turkey gizzards. I got them on sale at Family Fair here in town. And I decided I was craving them. So I decided I'm going to go ahead and cook some gizzards. I know some people don't like gizzards, but I love gizzards. I like chicken gizzards more than turkey gizzards. So I'm going to go ahead and um, cook them. What I do, I wash them really good. And to make sure you have to check so that it doesn't have the yellow stuffy in, in them. And then I just, they're all clean. Put them in a pot. I'm making as much and then I'll freeze some. Then I have onions and garlic in here. Then I'll just put this in. Put them in. I just go ahead and mix them really good. That you can add your spices, whatever spices you like. So I do some salt in there. I also do some curry porter in there. Do some Royco mix. This is a Kenyan spice. Let me show you how it looks. That's how it looks. It's just a beef flavor kind. I do about two cups of water and just put in there. Then let this boil for about 
on high, on about medium so I'll put um, medium high and let this boil for about 20 to 25 to 30 minutes and here is what are you eating don't eat don't eat letters you don't eat that you have your toys here baby girl so I put her toys close to her so that she she has them at arm's length and she can grab them and I have leftover brown rice from yesterday and I'll eat with the gizzards and I'll make some greens because I make mixed vegetable yesterday and I ate all of it so I'll have to make more and I haven't showered yet do my <laughs> I feel so bad saying this but I've been so lazy to get into the bathroom today I don't know why Marinia hasn't take Marinia did take her second nap and I was like yeah I'm gonna lay with her on the couch and we slept for about two hours and but I have to before I go to bed I have to shower because this is not good for the gizzard sauce what I use is green peppers red peppers some onions and celery and this is frozen so um, I got it from the frozen section and add some tomatoes and water so I put all this in the blender I'll put that and show you at the end then for it to be a little bit pepperish you can add some pepper I add a little bit of peppers in there I like it spicy so I put a lot of pepper in there the consistency of my paste and pot I put some olive oil in it and I use the extra virgin olive oil it should be good enough my gizzards in cook for a few minutes then I'll put in my sauce a bit of ginger um, if you had a uh, fresh ginger you would blend it but I have the powdered ginger the gizzard that I cooked so you I'll keep adding this to avoid it from sticking here I have I'm steaming some vegetable that I'll have with my brown rice the gizzards and that vegetable girl thinks that what is it called her pacifier is a toy Marinia hates pacifiers but she will chew on them as if this is a pacifier that is kind of like a teether so this is good for her but this kind of pacifiers she she doesn't like pacifiers so she'll bite on the thing thinking it's a toy Let me see. there we go exactly what I told you in the kitchen for about a good almost an hour and Marinia has been sitting there playing with those toys she doesn't cry Marinia is so mellow so calm uh, once she's just near me she's just okay are doing some playtime before her bath and she has this box like I told you guys that she really loves and then this book she was given by Taylor she loves the texture of it and also this ring she really loves that and I just put her there she plays with whatever she wants today we're gonna be reading the very hungry caterpillar and also this Sophie the color one like at bedtime when she's almost falling asleep i'll just read to her god bless you and good night book so yeah don't hurt yourself baby girl i wanted to ask you i don't know do you like i don't have any friends at all like i don't have friends at all so i find most of the time i end up talking to marinier and telling her stories like like she's an adult do you mothers do that like you talk to your child and sometimes I feel like when I talk when I'm so down and my day is not going so well and I just sit and talk to her I feel better like my like whatever was disturbing me is taken off my hands and I've shared it with Marinia she'll look at me um I know she doesn't understand what I'm saying but I feel better sharing it out with her uh yeah so do you mothers out there do that because this mama does it and it's getting to a point I'm thinking oh my god I really really need friends I really need like that motherly or even if she's not a mother just that other person that I can talk to and share like stuff with them or tell them I do share with my mom but you know there's some things you can't share with your mother like I don't my mom is in Africa I don't want to load her with so much stuff about my life she'll get worried my mom will take the next flight here but um, I just want if I would get like somebody I would talk to 
and like you know yes you can talk to people via skype or you can chat with people but if you had that physical person like you're so down and you have a shoulder to lean on and i would really love that i would really love to have a friend like that i'm trying to reach and marinia tries to crawl you'll see she'll lift her butt up techniques taylor is teaching me on helping marinia with crawling so once i have all that ready i will do a video for you guys so that anybody that wants to use this video to teach their child to crawl they it can be beneficial for them so that whatever she's sharing with me i don't just keep it to myself i share with you guys so once i have all the knowledge of everything and marinia has landed with the very very hungry caterpillar baby girl it says in the light of the moon a little egg lay on the leaf can you see the egg that's where the egg is do you see it and that's the big leaf you want to close the book okay let's turn it over let's turn it over let's turn it over to the other page then on sunday morning the warm sun came up and pop out of the egg came a little very tiny hungry caterpillar you hungry too are you a hungry caterpillar he started to look for some food on monday he ate through one apple but he was still hungry on tuesday he ate through two pears but he was still hungry this one i can do anything i can swing i can run i can strip you can sing you can run you can stretch i am ready to play the whole day through i can fly i can bounce i can swim i can hide and i can splash yes you can splash as we go take a shower you will splash and i can catch what can you do baby girl you can reach you can blow bubbles you can sit up so that's my dinner i have two gizzards and the soup or the sauce then some green beans and some brown rice. Myronia has showered. She's ready for bed. Are you, baby girl? She's ready for bed and I need to take a shower. So this is going to be the end of the night, guys. We'll talk to you tomorrow. Thanks, guys. Bye. And bump. She's lost her visitation. And another bump over there.